All right, hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is our official first full day in Accra, Ghana. Yeah. Yeah, so please like, comment, subscribe, and share. We're gonna be doing a lot of vlogging yeah. and bringing you guys along with us for our little adventures. So right now we are leaving Mama Christie's house. We're just walking around. We're gonna go get some, what are we getting babe? Wi-Fi. Yeah, we're going to the bank uh -huh. to get some cash. Uh -huh. and then get some Wi-Fi. Uh -huh. And then uh, just come home and rest. Hopefully, okay. yeah, maybe later in the evening I'll, I'll take You're you. You're walking out of frame. Maybe later I'll take you um, to this mall around. Mm -hmm so we can grab something to eat. Yeah, so today's gonna be a really chill day. We're still meeting a lot of the family and Andrew's dad is gonna come meet us a little later on as well. So today's gonna be really chill. Right now we're just walking. So yeah, we'll check in with you guys in a bit. It's hot. It's hot. But it's windy. I like it. Mm -hmm. It's hot, but at least it's cool air blowing. It's hot and yeah. this is, like, Oh my. Cream on your face. It's my sunblock. Oh. <laughs> First time trying public transport in Ghana. So it's called Trotro. So we're taking that, heading to the bank, and then from there we would go grab the Wi-Fi. First, of course, we need some internet to post some videos here. So we're going to rush. Let's rush. Yeah, guys, so that's the van. We're in the van now. Yeah, first time. Yeah. How do you feel? How do you feel? Oh, I feel okay. Okay. Is it too hot today? No. No, it was hotter yesterday. It feels better. When I was in the Philippines, I went with my friend Michael and I stayed at his family home with him. So this reminds me of the area because it was like really local. <laughs> wow. Except for it was a lot of like um tuk -tuk. Tuk -tuk, yeah, yeah. It's, yeah, it's not tuk -tuk, it's truck truck. <laughs> and even even the like public transportation it was a van. Like it was this. a van too. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Interesting. It's a lot of people out today. Yesterday it was like Desolate. Yeah, but, <laughs> because yeah. it was Sunday, right? It was Sunday yeah. and it was raining too. Yeah. So, but there's so many people out today. Yeah. This is where all the shops were closed. Everything yeah. was closed. Yeah. yeah. All right, so we're crossing the street, getting ready to go to the Echo bank, bank yeah. to get some moolah. I don't think we can we can video in the bank though. Okay. Oh, is that a queue? Alright guys, so we just left the bank. Um, we're walking to the telecom company, Vodafone, to to get the Wi-Fi sorted out. So yeah, we could have taken the cab, but just wanted to walk around for free to <laughs> to also look around and see how thing, things are here. Yeah. So yeah, you can, you can, you can see some things. Walking around. I don't have much to say. I'm too busy trying to look around at everything. So yeah, I don't have a lot to say. We'll check in with you guys later. <laughs> Yeah. 
Okay. 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 Oh, Anna, because I want to say, No, 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 I am for overhead. So, the end of the day. Daddy, you're pretty, I'm going to One peculiar thing about most African streets is street hawking. For those who are not familiar with this, street hawking is selling goods of any form along the street. This may include fruits and vegetables, cooking utensils, electronics, carpets, clothes, shoes, bottled water, carbonated drinks, snacks of various kinds, hair and body products, and many more. <laughs> We're done with the Wi-Fi, yeah? Yeah, we got the Wi-Fi, yeah. So yeah, we're done and uh, we headed to the electric company to get some prepaid so we can top up and then head home, yeah. It was a long process, it took about what? It took about two hours, right? I don't think two hours, maybe an hour. Maybe an hour and a half, because <laughs> we were there for a long time though. Okay. Yeah, so yeah, catch you guys later, yeah? Alright guys, so uh, we ordered some goat jollof fried rice with um, what's it called? Honey nice. slaw. So and, oh, and the supreme pizza. We ordered <laughs> supreme pizza. I don't know how it's going to taste, but you will tell me. All right, please don't tell me how it tastes because she's uh, the expert in, in pizza. So yeah, we're just waiting for our food. Mom is here with Alexander. Uh, yeah, say hi, mom. <laughs> <laughs> It's good, it's good. Mm. Perfect balance. Mm. Let's try the shito. Mm -hmm. I wonder how spicy it is. It might be a bit spicy than normal. Mm -hmm. No? Mm -hmm. It's good. Mm. It's actually not too spicy. It has a little kick to it, but not too spicy. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So overall, what do you think about the rice? Not the rice, what is it? The jollof, jollof rice. <laughs> overall, I would say taste-wise, appearance, everything. Mm. On a scale of one through 10. I would say 7.5. Okay. Yeah. I like it. I would say 7.5. You, but I feel like I don't know any better. <laughs> mm. 
Mm, yeah, like yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. So how would you would, rate you? I don't know. Uh, I would say maybe an eight. Okay. Okay. Ooh, mm. It looks good. Yeah. Yeah. So that's our review of what is it called? Star bites. Yeah. <laughs> So we're going to turn the camera off so we can yeah. see how we really want to. <laughs> and we'll catch up with you guys later tonight. Mm-hmm. Oh.